and welcome back to the channel on this video we're going to talk about the best two thousand dollar cruiser fat tire e-bike so i'm riding right now the lyric graffiti And I'm wondering if you were buying a cruiser style bike, e bike, and you had $2,000 to spend, what would you buy? Now, I racked my brain looking around to see if I was buying a cruiser style bike I don't think there's a better bike out there for the value anyway than the Wired Freedom it's currently selling for $2,000 they're taking pre-orders right now you, if you buy it now you won't get it they won't ship it uh, you won't be getting it till August but uh August is not that far away. Here we are in the last half of uh, the month of June. So, uh, but uh, that bike basically has it all. I mean, if you want power, speed, if you like the fat tire bike, 26 by 4 inch tires, 60 volt, I mean, I really don't think you can beat that bike. I'll tell you what, if you can, if you know of one that's better than that, let me know in the comments, because I've looked around and from what I can see that's out there, I don't think you can beat it. Especially when it comes to uh, having 60 volt. It's a 1000 watt motor that peaks at 2,000. I've heard that it peaks higher than that, but it's a uh, 40 amp controller on it, a 20 amp battery. Like I say, if you know one that's better, let me know in the comments. And uh, see which one it is. Let's see if I can get out of this intersection here. Because I've looked around and I mean, would you pick the Kepler aerial rider? Would you pick a, a Venton? Uh, I don't know. Maybe uh, Road Warrior, but I think that's a little more than two thousand dollars. Shop around for a cruiser e-bike and let me know if you can beat what this bike has to offer. Fired Freedom. It also has a rear rack. They uh, they list the speed limit or maximum speed on the bike, I should say, of uh, 35, carrying a 160-pound rider. You know, a lot of times when you're riding an e-bike, it's kind of hard to get it up there to uh, those kind of speeds. Especially if you're just riding around like I am right here on these uh, side streets. 
The speed limit here is, is 25 miles an hour. I mean, you can whip along faster if you wanted to, but there's a lot of stops and different things, you know, and it's really hard to get up to that kind of speed and, and maintain it uh, for any amount of time. You may have a short burst where you can get it up like that, but... Anyway, it's an interesting topic for anybody that's looking for a, a cruiser style of bike. And since this is a Father's Day weekend, I did want to also mention that Happy Father's Day to all the fathers out there for one. But the second thing I wanted to mention too is that there's some uh, sales going on right now. Uh, e-bike sales uh, many companies have uh, discounts going on right now and there's too many to list them all but uh, rad power bikes aventon juiced be cool all of those and there's many others like i say a lot of different ones with sales on right now aerial rider has sale going Quite a few uh, companies now, and they've been doing this for a while, but they'll offer you a deal if you're buying uh, two bikes, you know, an extra $200 off or something like that. So if you were getting one for uh, one of your kids or, and yourself or your wife or husband or parent or parents or whatever, you know, you'll get, you buy more than one, you get Usually they give you an extra hundred, if not a couple of hundred dollars off. Another nice day here in Oregon, but I'm afraid uh, we're going to get some cool uh, wet days ahead. And it's going to feel like almost like fall here for a little stretch before we uh, get back into summer. So let me know in the comments below if you uh, know of a bike that's better, that you think is better anyway, uh, than the Wired Freedom cruiser style fat tire e-bike that's no more than $2,000. And see if you can beat that. I think it's hard to beat it. That's going to do it for another video here on the channel. If you like this video, go ahead and hit the like button. If you'd like to subscribe to the channel, thank you very much. Go ahead and hit the subscribe button. And if you want to be notified as to when the next video comes up on the channel, just hit that notification bell and you'll be notified. So once again, thank you for joining me on this video. And until next time. Take care.